Hi, welcome to Nav's Comics. Hope you survived the experience. So, this is part one of four of my, let's see, this is April, last month was March, February. <laughs> this is my part one of my February haul. Um, yeah, I'm getting to it very late. So, here we are. It's been a while. Welcome back, uh, or welcome, yeah, either way. Both apply. So, all right, we'll just uh, hop right into it. So clearly I got Scorch number two up there. Uh, I got two copies of this. Wait, number two? Yes, it is number two. I got two copies, you know, a little little bit of speculator in me. Um, for no particular reason. Like, it's not like I saw something on this listing and said, yeah, let's do it. Okay, now we have A Righteous Thirst for Vengeance. Number five? It's like very... Uh, no... Yeah, like it's in a, it's in yellow. You can kind of see it. It's just really hard to read. <laughs> hard to read. Um, King Spawn number seven. Boy, this one. It's been a while since I've seen this. Oblivion Song number thirty-five. I imagine this one is ending somewhat soon. I think they're actually making a TV series out of it. All right, uh, Berserker number seven. And. I thought I had a foil. Yeah, here we are. <laughs> and then the foil version of it. So, because, you know, I'm a sucker. I'm from the... Let's say, I lived through the 90s. I was a sucker then. I'm a sucker now. Okay, uh, Joy Operations number four. I believe this might be a five-parter. I'm not 100% sure. Deadly Class number 51. A Fond Farewell Part 3. Um, the last book you'll ever read. It's funny because... Uh, silly. So, the last book... Vault. Like, so, I, I'm reading this. The last book, Vault. No, that is, no, Vault is the publisher. Okay. The last book you'll ever read. And what number was this? Like, five? Yeah, number number five. At the bottom, I didn't notice that right away. All right, we have Noctera, number eight. I already got a copy of this uh, through a short box winning. And Crossover, number 12. Uh, kind of a meta cover. Because the person on the cover is, it looks like they're probably reading issue one that had that cover. <laughs> so, um, Department of Truth, number 23. Man, hard to believe it's been that long. And here we have House of Slaughter, number five. And I'll pull this down. All right, this is, okay. Couple left here. Uh, Joy Operations, number three. I showed you number four earlier. I got number three here. Uh, the Magic Order 2, number 5. Another one I uh, had received from Shortbox. Uh, in addition to this one. Here we have Gunslinger Spawn, number 5. Digging this cover quite a bit. And then I got two copies of it. I don't remember if that was... Uh, what kind of spec that was, if any. Or if I was just thinking about... I believe... Image wasn't reprinting. I don't know if they are yet, but to my knowledge, as of as of January, they weren't doing reprints. And so I just thought, you know what? I'll I got a couple couple copies because I'm, I'm like that. Not like there's gonna be not like you know these issues are sparse or something uh, or scarce. So, all right. Well, thank you so much for watching my indie haul. I don't know if I said that at the start. My indie haul uh, coming up. Don't know the order of DC, Marvel, and then a separate one for X-Men, which is a pretty light month this month. So um, that'll be a pretty short one. This one's kind of short. All right. Well, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Take care.